So, we're going back to Spring Hill, uh, cemetery and the uh, the abandoned neighborhood. The we neighborhood, yeah, that's it. So, and we actually have gear this time, unlike um, you know last time where we just kind of went there and hoped for something to happen, even though it was very unlikely. We have a spirit box and a EMF reader, which I think we have two of the EMF readers, so I think we'd be good. He's just here being pregnant, as you know, Chubbs always does. Anyway. Um, yeah, we'll be going there hoping to get something paranormal and yeah. Yeah, paranormally we don't do this. <laughs> don't subscribe to him. Anyway, we will see you there. Honestly, it should be Bye. a few seconds for you, but it's going to be hours for us. So. Oh, yeah, see major update because a lot has happened uh, when I when I first did this it was hours ago but now it's literally it's four in the morning yeah it's literally four in the morning a lot has happened I have updates on other stuff including we got a hotel room and there's blood in there oh that's one there's blood in there just blood and a drawer opened on right, own, so. which was kind of nuts we are on the way to the cemetery now, because we want to get there before 5, because that, uh, you know, ghost hour. So, yeah, we'll see you when we get there. Alright, guys, I'm not showing my face because we're here, but it, it, we have 15 minutes to, you know, talk to spirits, so. I mean, we can still do it after, it's just not as active. Alright, so, I just did a little quick update, because we're here, if you look. That is the fence. Ooh. And I will start recording when we have all of our equipment ready. So I will see you then. Alright guys, we're in the cemetery. Yo, wait, what the fuck is that? What? On the tree. Oh, is that a shit stain? What the fuck? Oh, that's just sap. We're kind of retarded. The trees are. Anyway. Yeah, because there was a fucking ghost F-150. <laughs> I'll see Gucci. I'm just... Trying to... Everywhere you're aiming the flashlight, I'm trying to aim that. Still nothing on the EMF, by the way. You heard that too, right? Where? Back there. It might have been just an animal, but... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, shit, it's going off. Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, my... Something oh. just walked right near us. Footsteps. Are you sure that's not ours? All right, uh, let's see. I mean, it's oh, yeah, that's a... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It, it's really... Oh, it's... Good. It might have been just an animal, but... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, shit, it's going off. Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, my. Something just walked right near us. Footsteps. Footsteps. Are you sure that's not ours? All right, uh, let's see. I mean, it's oh, kinda... yeah, that's the same. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It, it's really Oh, it's good. going off. Wait, is that me? No. No, that's not me. That can't be us. Yo, that was really going off. Should I get the spirit box out? Yeah. Oh, it was just going off. Hello? Hello? It's just leaf falling. But there's no wind. So that's kind of odd. By the way, Cody said this on his video, but if you guys see anything at all on the camera that we don't. And be careful when looking up because you might see a hanging body for a second. I just don't want to see that creature in the woods like Omar Gosh did. <laughs> but now that I said it, it's probably be like a surprise. 
Bravo, motherfucker. I keep getting a shit ton of chills. That car noise is too close to be... Com for comfort, at least. Hello? Anybody here? Here, let's do the thing where we set this down. If there's any ghost here, please touch that remote on the ground. Things that usually only work when there's no Whoa. camera. Whoa, aim it over there. I just saw something move. It might have been dark, but I saw it. I saw someone walking. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hello? Can you touch my hand? I didn't even... Can you mess with my flashlight? Please? Oh, it's low. It's... That went from four to low. Can you, uh... Oh, shit, I shouldn't have said that. God Shit. Damn we got to go back to the car, because that's our only main well, flashlight. Well, it's, we just went from full battery to instantly low, because I said something that I shouldn't have said. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for doing that. You showed that you were here. I appreciate it, but, you know, I should have said a different device. <laughs> oh, shit, we better get back to the car before it dies. Is there a way to... Yeah, I know for a fact it's going to die right before we get back to the car. At least we have your phone. Oh, yeah, my phone. I mean, my phone was all we really had last time. I know this was a short trip, guys, but... We'll, we'll probably be back tonight. Unless we can get this thing to charge while we're in Hopefully the hotel actually, you know, is going to be a hotel and not kick us out today. And it'll kick us out tomorrow so we can come back maybe tomorrow night. I hate to do this to you, Josh, but if a spear here can turn this flashlight off, do it. Alright, no? Okay. <laughs> I was hoping. Ooh, ooh. Can you turn this flashlight off? Oh, wow. Please? That went all the way. Oh my oh god. Oh my lord. Oh Help. my god. Can you turn this flashlight off? Dude, they're touching me. I felt. They're gone. They gave me a hug or something. That was crazy action. Oh god. Oh, that was, a, that was the most chills I've ever had in my life. Holy sh... Oh, guys, that felt really crazy. I think we should at least... Dude, I'm actually getting goosebumps. Hang we on. We should hang out near the car put it, until put the it, flashlight dies. Put it... Yeah. I don't know if you can see, but I had I did have chills. Hey, let's turn the, the power down so we can at least hang out around here for a little longer. No, now I'm getting warm. That's an odd sensation. This is definitely a hot spot. I'm not saying, yo. What, 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 what? I just saw something running across that tree. All right, let's keep going. If you can do anything to any of the things I'm holding, please do it. Or, you know, me. Turn off my camera or something. Oh, so we were standing like right here when the light from the gatekeeper happened. Well, we did get a lot of action on camera. Now I think the main part is actually going back to the hotel room and waiting it out and see what's happening. I know it was a short trip here. Oh. Where? Right here. Hello? Can you touch my hand? 
Just give me a little touch. Oh, trying to. it did. No, it did. Tell me, show me that you're here by holding my hand. If you're comfortable with it. Hello? Are you still here? Can you grab my hand? Or can you touch the remote? I'll, I'll have it a little bit out for you so you can touch it. Did you hear her crying? No, I, I heard nothing at all. I heard crying. All right. Um, oh, it went off again. No, it's because I pressed the button. Oh. Let's go back to the car. What if the car was just gone? I would cry. <clears throat> uh, we're getting close to the gate. Can you please turn my flashlight off for me? If you're here. Turn the car on, maybe. I don't know. What if the car turned on and just drove away? I think I would shit myself. Well, I just saw something by that tree again, which is... Uh, all right, I'm not going to stop recording. Not even want to get in the car. Let's look at the car. Well, let's let's inspect it at that one gas station. All right. Oh, you can see a lot. Oh, my bad. I was just making sure there was nothing behind us. Well, that was a fulfilled experience a little bit. Had the, you know, flashlight started dying because he had to fucking say something about it. My bad, I didn't mean to. <laughs> it's fine. I that... don't. I didn't, I never knew ghosts can just drain batteries. Like, I never knew yeah. they could just kill it, kill it off. Yeah, my phone's at 22. Not bad for 10 minutes of recording. So I think we might be good now. I'm so glad we got actual paranormal stuff. Yeah, we got a lot of that. Once you I can't explain the amount of chills I got. I've never gotten that amount of chills before. Dude, my all. I felt my my hair on my head sticking up. It got that bad that I felt sticking up on my head. All right, guys, so here's a little uh, thing I learned today. This road here, Fort Dade Road, is the most haunted road in the country. What if we drive up and down this after checking out the car a little bit? I guess we could do that a few times. But uh, yeah, this is pretty cool road, most haunted road in America. Glad we get to see it. Shut the fuck up. Ding, ding, ding. Yeah, apparently this is the most haunted road in the U.S. that we just learned today. Which is pretty crazy. I've seen so many videos on this, but I didn't realize this was Fort Dade until I saw a road sign. Well, I know, like, maybe a road connected to a cemetery is haunted, but I never knew this was the most haunted. We got the most haunted cemetery in the state and the most haunted road in the I should also check that. Oh, see the dash cam? Yeah, see if I got Don't it. Don't you have to wait until you get home? Um, sadly, yes. I, I believe unless I have a adapter here. I feel bad for the poor suckers who have to live on this road. At least you don't walk on it at night. Alright guys, we're going to go on that spooky road and I set the camera up very strategically. As you can see. I don't think I need flash anymore. I'm just gonna have it on anyways. Uh, All right, guys, we are currently on the uh most well, haunted road in America, and apparently... You can turn off your uh, flash, so you know. So apparently, uh, in, on this road, it is known that you can see a woman in a white dress. So if you see that, let me know. It's really foggy out on my camera. No, I'll, I'll wait till we get to the, uh, what he needs to first. Hey, howdy, howdy. Where 
been stopped? Uh, yeah. They, they walk, like, you know that area where uh, the cemetery is? Yeah. That's where they stopped the park. And then they walked out. I don't feel like doing that today. I'll cruise at a low speed, but I'm not going to go any slower than like 20. I don't think you'll see I one. might pull over because there's a person behind me. But there's a cemetery. Yeah, this is where they park. This is where all the stuff happened. I mean, up here is probably where you can just speed up and we can go back to the hotel. I don't know. There, there is that woody part, remember? car behind us. That would, that would be weird. Wait, what the fuck? What? The car literally just disappeared. I'm not joking. Holy shit, it did. Just slow down. Maybe it was just a hill, but this is what I mean, man. Baby part. No, like, I saw it disappear. It's gone. Fuck, we didn't even get it on camera. Fuck. Well, I didn't think we had to. It disappeared right as soon as I turned my phone off. Bruh. Like, I literally just saw the lights fade away. They didn't turn or anything. It did the same thing in Omar Gosh's video. Just gone. That's gay. Stupid ass. Alright, guys. That car that was following was... Us, like I said, it was directly right behind us, and then, bam, gone. I'm kind of sad it did it as soon as I turned you guys off. I'm sad. And obviously, because my camera's pointing to the front, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, and his camera's pointing towards the front. See, it's not, it's not behind us anymore. But, you know, we screwed up again. Turned my camera off, and something happens. That that thing hanging up there scared me for a second. <laughs> I'm just hoping my camera will catch catch something that we won't see. It's gonna catch these nuts up in the back of the face. That's weird. I know, right? That sound means it's recording. That means it caught something. Unless it's turning off. The screen turns off, but that's about it. Shady dash cam must have just caught something. Damn, we got a lot of stuff happening tonight. Because you do realize how the whole time we were sitting down, the car was on and it didn't do anything? Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, we were kind of sitting there for a while after you put it back. All right, guys. Well, I guess I 
if I would have gotten anything, it's there now, so. Did you just see that? What? In the mirror, I just saw car lights, but in this one, I didn't. That's, that's odd. That's really odd. Alright, guys, well, I'm going to turn it off now, because we're out of the road. And, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. I will update probably when I get home, after I edit the main part of the video, and then do a finale. But yeah, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, and yeah, you'll see what really happens next in a few seconds. It'll be a bit of a span for us, but yeah, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Alright guys, I don't know much, how much battery life I have left. I don't know if I have another battery on me. Although, we are back, obviously, during the day. Um, we decided to stop back here for another time to see it during the day, because we never have seen it during the day. And so we were hearing stuff and getting a lot of stuff like over there. And it was by where the doll was in Omar Gosh's video. So we're just kind of roaming through here, seeing what, seeing if we can get anything. It sucks that this place was abandoned because there's a lot of families here. A lot, as you can see. <clears throat> guys so <clears throat> a little update on what's happening or what happened last night so we were hearing footsteps all throughout the woods and we were getting a lot of readings on our little uh, EMF reader like a ton you'll see it and um, not only that but uh, Cody decided to see if the ghost could do something with the flashlight and he said like do something with the flashlight and it went from full battery or at least 75% to zero. Or at least a few percent so we could at least get back to the car and then it died at the gas station. But we had to leave because that was our really only good flashlight. We didn't have anything else except for phones to give us or provide light. But this place is extremely haunted during the day. Obviously it's not as bad, but during the day any scary place isn't as bad. I don't... I think I got a few things on camera, like, um, I swear I got, like, this woman in the woods over here, somewhere over there, when he shined the flashlight, I swear I saw, like, maybe a woman or something, but I'm not positive because I can't be sure because it was, it was far away and it could have literally just been something reflecting that was wet or something. Other than that, we do not mean any harm being here. We just are here to see if we can get something, see if we can talk to spirits and see if we can actually have a conversation with them. It's a very low chance for at least us, because we never have gotten that yet. The main thing we have gotten is, I don't, know, I don't think I explained it fully last night, but there's the gate all the way over there. You can see it that's that that's it like right there <laughs> but over there um we got or last time we were here we were walking through it we were here for about a good 30 minutes when we decided to walk over here where i'm at because this is the spot where oh my gosh found like a doll or something but as we were walking over here it might have still been here and then it might have someone might have taken it when we finally, you know, came back, or in that time span. And when we were walking over here, something in me wanted to turn around and look at my car. I don't know why, but right before this, keep noted that I said, one of my worst fears is something happened to my car, because if there's something happens to my car, how are we going to get out? Like, a slash tire? I mean, I, I probably would have still, like, drove it on rims, but... 
yeah, that's one of my worst fears is having something into my ha having something happen to my car while we're here and we can't get out because our safety is obviously my number one priority. But anyway, we will be coming back. We will be trying to maybe camp here at some point. I want to try to contact the people that own this place and maybe we can do something like that or not but knowing owners of cemeteries they probably won't allow it but yeah guys I think that's about it uh, you're mostly all updated so I guess a bit of my YouTube channel so I'm not going to do Gmail anymore I might upload maybe a video here and there so I kinda lied I might do Gmod but it's a very low chance that game has just it brings back bad memories from the past now, basically, with everything going on with me and Chubbs and the Frisky Frog since we split, and either way, we've I've played it too much, and it's just gotten slightly boring to me. But it's not completely dead, I'll say. I will play it sometimes here and there, but I won't play it a lot. What I want to play, and what I want you guys to see me play, is horror games, because I really enjoy horror games. See, originally, my YouTube channel, for my YouTube channel, I wanted to be known for my horror games, or playing horror games. But, obviously, I launched from Gmod, and that's what you guys want to see. So, it's not gonna, I'm not gonna completely get rid of it, but I'm not gonna play it n anywhere near as much as I did before. It's not gonna be an everyday thing. It's gonna be like, maybe, if anything, a once a week thing, if, at most. Um, so yeah, that guys, that's about it for this video. If you guys like it, give a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos like these, and yeah, I'll see you later. And make sure to comment down below your favorite, let's see, your favorite ghostly experience. Or actually, no, comment down below your, your personal ghostly experience. So, honestly, I don't know if I'm going to put this at the beginning of the video or the end. So, if anything, enjoy the video. Oh, 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 oh,